Hey y'all, welcome or welcome back to another video. And in today's video, it's a get ready with me to play Frenchie. So this is my third show. Tomorrow's my last show, which is kind of sad, but I'm also kind of happy because this has been a little stressful. But anyway, so first we're going to do my hair. I do wear two wigs, so I wasn't really too worried about how, like, my curls look, as you can see. I just did straining iron curls. Um, but yeah, so I do do, like, a little bump. So I'm just going to gather some hair in the front like this. Uh, maybe a little bit more. So this is my senior show and I was on the news yesterday. I got interviewed, which was pretty cool. I've never gotten interviewed before. But now I'm just going to take my comb out and tease my hair each time. I'm gonna get a little bit more. Tease it a tiny bit. Again, I wore two wigs, so it's not like this matters too much. And then I'm gonna twist it a little bit. Look at that, hold on. I need to get more hair. There we go. Twist. I'm trying to remember how I did it for a dance I had to do. I don't think I got it. <gasps> I got it. <laughs> there we go. So I'm just bobby pinning it. Again, it doesn't have to look like, perfect. I only wear this hairstyle for the first act anyway. It really should be okay. And I think that's more bumpier than it was the, the last two shows. So, there we go. These are pimple patches, by the way. I just like to put a bunch of bobby pins in there. And I'll pop, probably bobby pin it a little bit more, too. And then the rest of my hair will go into a little ponytail, just like this. I try to give it high enough to where, like, it's not a low ponytail, but low enough to where all I have to do is flip it up to put my wig cap on. So I have to be up at the school by 6 and I have no idea what time it is right now. So, yeah. And then I put on this little ribbon. It does have hearts on it, but it's fine. I don't think you can see the hearts from backstage or from the audience. And plus it's just tied up in my hair. And a little bow. Just like that. And then we're going to put on a little hairspray on the sides. Slick all the flyaways back. Put a little bit more in the curls. Okay, there we go. And now, time for the makeup. So we gotta obviously take these out, off these pimple patches. There we go. If 
I've only had them on for a couple hours. So, probably didn't do much of nothing. Okay, next. I think this is the full one. Yes. Next is foundation. Um, I don't really know what to say. Um, I don't know, Finch is a really cool character to play. She's really, like, I feel like she's really interesting and everything. Like, you can go in depth with Frenchie. Like, I was playing her the other day, yesterday. And just during beauty school dropout, I was like, where are these girls' parents? Because, you know, she's like, I think they they might be juniors or seniors in high school. And her parents are letting her drop out of not only high school, but beauty school. So, where are your parents, for girl? And also, this, the play, the musical, so much more different than the, um, the movie. Like, it's so much different, but it's okay. Like, it doesn't really make a lot of sense. And even, this line is even in the movie. Frenchie goes, gee, the whole crowd's together again. I could cry, girl, where have you been? We've been here the entire time. <laughs> the crowd has been together this entire two hours. What do you mean, gee, the whole crowd's together again? We've been here. We've been together. And then in the play, we go together is in a burger palace. And it's right after Sandy and Rizzo fight. Because in the play, um, Sandra D is in the Burger Palace. Which is also kind of weird. But, you know, it's okay. I don't know, this play, the play is weird because, like, Rizzo and Kaneki fight, and then, um, <laughs> sorry, I'm blinking, and then Rizzo and Sandy fight, and then everybody thinks that that's just a great opportunity to ask everybody to the dance, and then we sing We Go Together, right after a fist fight. And then right after Rizzo sings the worst things I could do in front of Sandy, the next scene, they're besties and she's helping her get Danny. And it's just weird. And in the movie, Danny is a thousand and ten percent gay. Like he just he is. Cause I ain't never seen a straight man strut the way that Danny Zuko struts in the movie. Like, we, the entire cast as a collective has decided that Danny Zuko is secretly gay. Because they need one straight man that can strut like that and move his hips like that, unironically, and not performing. Oh, wait. <laughs> you can't. It's raining. I don't know how to deal with it because my hair. I'm gonna have to bring my little mini umbrella. I think I'm gonna take a, a film picture before I leave because we're just so cute. I need to do my scrapbook. I'm behind, girl. And I kind of. I picked up my room a little bit today 
I just haven't had the time or the energy to because after rehearsals it's just been a lot like I have not been to class all week and I know next week I'm gonna be swamped with like makeup work and everything like that's why I have such a love-hate relationship with show week because I love that I'm getting out of class but I don't love that I then have to make up all the work for that class that I missed so I'm trying to make my makeup look natural but at the same time stage makeup is supposed to be a little bit more out there so yeah on uh, yesterday i forgot to put on my, a little bit of contour yesterday when i came out in the pink wig i heard someone say oh i was like yeah thanks guys because it was in front of the school it's like thanks much appreciated Um, yeah, but I have that wig change. It's quick, but it's not as quick anymore because she lets us exit the stage a little bit earlier now, which I'm very grateful for because I had to change wigs and then put this costume on over top of my dance dress which I mean I still have to do that anyway but I was just it makes it a lot easier and the boys also it gives them more time to change because they have to change like entire outfits so I'm really happy that she decided to let us um to let us exit the stage a little earlier yeah but it does make the next scene a little bit harder to change because I have to take off two costumes instead of just one and yesterday we did come on a little late me and a girl that plays Marty but it wasn't like it was kind of our fault but it was also kind of the tech's fault because they brought the lights up too late but it was okay no one was mad. It didn't look awful by any means. We talked to the uh, our teacher after, and she said that it was fine that stuff like that happened, and that she's not mad, which was great because I was a little bit worried that she was gonna be a little bit mad at us, but she wasn't. So, and then I also made the the scene change a little quicker than they normally do so we were still used to being to them taking a little bit longer to change the set than it took them so today we're gonna change a bit faster it's a little dark but it's okay because you kind of want it to be a little bit dark um to kind of make it show up on stage and like the people around you so next mascara i don't i'm not wearing falsies 
I don't want to. I was thinking about wearing the individual ones, but I just didn't really feel like it. So I'm not. <laughs> and I think my mascara is good enough. And then I top when I get there, I top it off with my Estee Lauder one as well. And then I use my Estee Lauder lip liner and lipstick to line. Why is this not working? There you go. Let me take the lipstick. I did that lip liner kind of messy. Last thing is my earrings. I wear my competition earrings from dance, even though I don't dance anymore. Oh. But they still look banging on stage. So. And that's the Frenchy look. I have a little touch-up bag that I'll, I'll show you what I have in it after I put on or put in a little bit more bobby pins. See, I get bobby pin crazy. When it comes to this bump. in here oh, I have a little deodorant stick I have some powder and then I have some like face and then I have my lipstick my lip liner a mascara some little brushes a brush bobby pins and extra little hair ties And that is it. That's basically everything you need. So that's 
my Frenchy look. Um, yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. Deuces!